the deepness of oceans, who is the master of master and the lord of lord. First of all, I want to say Assalamu alaikum to all present here. Introduce myself. I am Asran Rajput from class 10th A2. Today I am very lucky and glad to have a chance to come front of you and could share my, uh, some words with you, could represent my speech. Today the topic of my speech is practice makes the man perfect. Practice. What does practice mean? Practice means doing one work again and again till you become better in that or you knew it. There are so many benefits of practice. Through practice many people became specialists in so many difficult works. Uh, our history is full of those successful persons who got success through hard working and practice. I also want to share a couple of stories with you. Number one, Pablo Picasso. <clears throat> Pablo Picasso has been one of the great painters of his time, even greater than M. F. Hussain. Once he was walking in the street of New York, suddenly a woman saw him and recognized that he was a great painter, Pablo Picasso. She very firstly ran and took a paper and asked him to, uh, to draw something on that uh, for her. He took the paper and draw something on it and gave it to her in 30 seconds. And said, hey, and said, hey lady, its cost is 50 lakh rupees. She didn't believe. And then she tried to find a sexual amount. Everyone said that it's Pablo Picasso's painting. We can give you 50 lakh rupees. She was shocked to see that how a person can paint a painting in just 30 seconds worth rupee of 50 lakh rupees. And then she uh, tried to find Pablo Picasso and when she found him, she said, I want to know and learn that how you draw the painting in just 30 seconds worth rupee of 50 lakh. Then Pablo Picasso said, hey lady, the painting which you saw in 30 seconds worth rupee of 50 lakh, I have spent 30 years of my life to draw it in just 30 seconds. That was, <laughs> that was just possible because of practice. He had done a lot of practice to draw it in 30 seconds. And uh, secondly, Major Dhyan Chand. Major, uh, Major Dhyan Chand was a magician player in hockey. Uh, he, was, uh, uh, he was a hockey player, but he used to practice on a regular tracks to have a strong balance on the ball. Once he was playing in Olympic, he couldn't score half time of the match. Coach said, we are going to lose if you couldn't score in half time. Uh, he said, stop the match, there is something wrong. And when the match was stopped and uh, referee came with the measuring tool and when he measured the uh, goal pass, it was two for short. That was just happened because he, has, he was quite sure that I have done a lot of practice on my game. It is impossible that I couldn't goal even half, uh, half time of the match. And uh, 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 this is uh, uh, tale us at the end of speech. I, I, I only would like to say you that uh, nothing, is, uh, nothing is gonna happen by saying that I don't understand physics, I don't understand math. Just go home, make some practice, and be specialist in that.